Yo, what's going on, you guys? Awful Parts, welcome back to a brand new Fortnite video. Today, we're gonna be checking out a new POI edited game here called The Collection, which essentially is an island full of selected items as a collection that's been collected from the few seasons all across the Fortnite seasons up until now. It's, I, that's a, I, that sounds such a, like a weird. Why did I say it like that? Let's just get right into the video. For those of you guys that might be wondering about this POI, it's just been recently added so you guys might need to update your Fortnite game, but pretty much this is going to be located just at the bottom right corner of the map here on a snowy mountain between a candy corner and retail row. And you guys can kind of see it as I make my way over there, but as we go and actually make our way over there as well, if you guys could do me a solid favor guys, I have been grinding out this season of Fortnite for you guys. I've been uploading all of your awakening challenges, your secret challenges, as well as the wolverine challenges and more, and even your weekly challenges were all caught up for everything so if you guys could do me a solid if you guys haven't already and check those videos out go and check them out give them some love drop a like on the video comment share it all that good stuff i would greatly greatly appreciate it and low-key if that wasn't enough of an incentive for you guys i'm doing a giveaway all right i've been putting out on those comments for those videos that if those videos hit 50 likes we'll give away a battle pass I haven't done it we'll do it for this one too this video hits 50 likes do it a battle pass giveaway it looks like people are landing here i'm kind of scared but I know there's a chest around here and I do want to get it, but uh, I don't want to break everything. So I'm going to go through this side first so I can get the chest. We have the Tilted Towers Clock Tower Clock here, as you guys can see. And you guys can actually see this kind of almost everywhere at the point of this map, or at least in some cases. I know Misty Meadows actually has this on their clock tower, so we can actually open it up. And no, this is not actually accurate to what time it is right now, so don't think that that's what that is. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and open this up because... If somebody comes here, I want to be able to bop them in case they come out with a shotgun, then I probably don't stand a chance. So, either way, as I go ahead and mini up here, we actually have a part of the comet. Now, if you guys remember, this was a big thing from a couple seasons ago, uh, the big asteroid, the comet that came down onto the map. This is it right here. And also, if you guys remember Dusty Depot from a couple of seasons ago, they actually had parts of the comet or the asteroid or whatever you guys want to call it actually displayed in Dusty Depot. So, this was something that uh, is kind of like making a return here for the collection POI. And you could actually farm this and it gave you a pretty decent amount of metal as well and because at Dusty Depot they actually had so many of them you could get away with a lot and I mean like a lot of, uh, of metal mats. And then moving on to this one I believe this is like season 8, season 7? I don't even remember but there was a point where we had like ninjas versus pirates or pirates versus ninjas and kind of dragons. I see a guy up there and I'm kind of scared. I hope he doesn't come down here. Anyways, there was an actual thing where you could get like these cannonballs and then shoot the cannonballs into, uh, you know, stuff and, and break things. Or you could launch yourself from the cannonball itself. Is this guy gonna kill me? He broke it! He's here to kill me! Ah! I'm bad. I'm terrible. I'm terrible. I'm so bad. I panicked. I knew, see, I knew it. I didn't even get a chance to, I'm just happy he didn't break everything, okay? Let's just be glad he was bad enough that he couldn't, like, you know? All right, let's just put this away. But yeah, so we had a cannonball. You could put yourself in the cannonball and then launch yourself out and use it, you know, kind of like a, like a bounce pad or a jump pad or anything like that so you can get from one place to another. And then also you had the option to actually pick up cannonballs and then put them in the cannon and then use them to, to chuck at people from like distances and stuff. So it's kind of cool. And then moving on to the next one here, we have an egg. Now I don't exactly remember what this is from and the only real eggs that I remember from Fortnite were the dragon eggs. But I don't really remember them being this big. So if you guys actually remember what this is from, let me know down in the comments below. That'd be absolutely helpful. Now I'm going to go and open this up, break this for some more mats. And as you guys can see here, we have a toilet. Now, I don't know if this is really a reference to anything because pretty much the map always has toilets. But if we're talking in terms of this collection, this toilet would be specifically, in my opinion, related to Flush Factory, which was so, so many seasons ago. Literally, it was a POI called Flush Factory, I believe, where it had just tons and tons of toilets. It was literally a toilet factory at that point. So I think that's what that's in reference to. This one is supposed to have a chest in it. So I guess this POI doesn't have a 100% spawn rate like I thought it would. But uh, yeah, there's a toilet right there. And yes, everything here is breakable. You can even break this whole thing, which breaks the whole thing up there. Basically like make this whole thing just have nothing on it. But obviously you can't break the POI itself. And then going on in here, sometimes this will actually spawn a bunch of these ammo crates. 
I don't think this really has reference to anything, but it's just really good for being able to open up, get a lot of stuff early. Now, if we actually try to move up to this one, you can see that there's actually a rocket ship up there. And I don't exactly remember from which season this is supposed to be talking about, but this could be in reference to like one of the first few seasons. Hello, is that guy? He didn't stick the landing. That would have been so nice if I could have just stole that kill right there. But I swear I did see a rocket ship during the cutscene when we actually got to talk to Jonesy and everything just before this season started. So I'm really not too sure. Well, was it this season or, or the season before, like season one, chapter two? I don't even remember at this point. For whatever it is, you know, there was a rocket there. It could be a reference to many things. I kind of like to think it was in reference to the one where the visitor got in the rocket and, and kind of flew off, but who knows and then over here it's a three decker like collection thing so i'm actually gonna go to top and then we can start from there this one usually has a chest in it as well so obviously we can just break that and then this one here i believe this is supposed to be like one of like the mascots or the characters that were holding balloons or something like that from the chapter one i want to say like season 10 season 9 for the futuristic retail row and the tilted towers which was like neo neo towers or something like that but this was in uh retail row in one of the shops and i think that's what this is in reference to i'm pretty sure but if, if i get anything wrong here let me know down in the comments below right away because I, I would like to know i would like to be informed properly you know but i'm pretty sure that's what that was i'm pretty sure there was one more other character along this side of the sky but I'm, I'm not too sure and then going into the triple decker obviously we have the gnomes we have the big gnome battle between the bears that's something that you guys need to keep up note of as well but this is also something where if you guys didn't know you guys could also go ahead and sometimes when you build a wall with your brick you would actually see a gnome stuck in place of like one of the bricks so that's something you guys can know about as well and then moving down to the next one here you guys can see again we do have the bears so it was like the bears versus the gnomes and then also also, these bears have been in Fortnite for so long, you could just basically find them tucked in attics and bedrooms and stuff like that. So it's really nothing too crazy. But this might be the most important one right here. This is in reference to one of our chapter one, chapter what? Hello? Chapter one, can't remember which season, but it was the big war between the Durburgers and the pizza people. I don't remember the name of this POI, but it was, it, it was, it was a good time. It definitely was a good time. If you guys can remember the name of this POI, let me know down in the comments below. This is actually going to bug me for so long. I would search it up, but I... I, I, I can't because by the time I search it up the video is already done recording but it was funny because I was here earlier just like scoping the place out and whatnot and there's actually a guy who was here and he was like doing the crying emote next to it and then we cried together he gave me his stuff I killed him it was a great time I'll see if I still have the clip somewhere and I'll put it in where I'm talking but it, it was a long time ago that back when I guess almost some people would say Fortnite was still good I still think Fortnite's still good but you know to each their own and so pretty much like that is all really that is here I don't know if this POI is just gonna keep updating and updating with more and more items as a collection and whatnot so we're gonna have to wait and see what happens with that but that's basically all there is to it for the collection now the circle is actually not too far and i do want to kind of see if that guy's loot is still there the guy who actually ended up offing himself over there because if that guy had at least some decent loot then i can you know somewhat loot it up and it seems like maybe he didn't even loot up that much i don't even know yes oh still a chest in this roof okay bet that's great give me an ar nice can actually go ahead and use this. Still a chest in here as well. I know the circle's coming, so I'm going a little bit tight on time here. <gasps> Shotgun and a half pot. Ooh, okay, this is tough. This is tough. Okay, so that guy didn't actually have like decent loot at all, honestly. Like he had a purple scoped, and that that's just really not worth it. So that's kind of like an L for me. Fortnite is so different these days. Not even these days, like these these last couple of seasons. Because I remember playing Fortnite when like there would be so many people still left by the end of the game. And at this point, there's like no one at the end of these games. There's 10 people. Okay, so what do you got for me? What do you got for me, baby? You got a hot fish, I'll eat it. You got attack SMG, I'll take it. And we've got a thermal fish. Okay, listen, I'm gonna do this for the content, but if you guys have never seen a thermal fish, this is what it does, all right? Trippy. Oh my goodness. This might actually give away my position, but hopefully I can actually see him. I think I see him right there. Can you not move for like a minute here, bud? I need him to stop moving though. I missed. I'm dead. <laughs> I think that's it, boys. Oh, uh, well, you know, we were here to only show off the collection anyway, so let me see. Ah, I missed. You don't see me, right? You're chill. Oh, he saw me. Dude, it's legit like we're playing arenas in its own way. Like, this is so weird. 105. Man, everybody, everybody's playing like super, super serious, serious. You know what I'm saying? Holy. What?
Oh, he's cracked. I feel like that guy's hella weak right now. He's like in here healing, I'm pretty sure. Kinda need that loot, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, oh, okay, I see why. I get it. Jesus. It kinda sucks that no one's helping me out here, bro. I got it, and I can't even get the loot. How sad, bro. Well, it's a 1v1 now, and your boy doesn't have that many kills. I don't even know where he's shooting from. Where is he? Woohoo! 105. You scared? Because I am. Where the heck did this guy go? Oh, he's down there now. What the? You're a sneaky dog. Hello? He's out of mats. Hmm. It's in the water now. Oh, it's not him. I thought that fish was him. Oh, I made a mistake. Oh, I'm out of mats. Oh! I almost lost, too. I'm out of mats. I'm out of mats. <laughs> Yo, I played like a straight bot. I'm not even gonna lie. What the heck was that, bro? You should not have let me win. Just... <laughs> Uninstalled. <laughs> Alright, there you guys have it. That has been me showing you guys, hopefully, a good rundown of what was at the new collection POI. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did remember to drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already, turn on post notifications here on the channel, but hit that bell icon next to the subscribe button. That way you guys don't miss out every time I upload a new video here to the channel. As well as guys, I've been streaming a lot over on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Live. The link will down in the description below. So if you guys want to join me, the rest of the Arts Fam community, to talk in the chat, get some games, and have a good time. Again, come and drop a follow for me over on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Live. Again, the link will be down in the description below. Thank you guys again for watching. Catch on the flip side, Arts out. I can't believe I won. That is absolutely ridiculous.